Hello fellow YouTubers, and welcome back to Pokemon Crystal Random Lock. On the last episode, we headed inside the Olivine City Gym to go fight Jasmine, the Olivine City Gym Leader. We quickly found out that it was a Steel-type gym, which is one of the new two types from this generation. <laughs> and also, there was no one in the gym other than Jasmine. So we just immediately fought her, and uh, used Randy for the entirety of it, and managed to win. Although we did get hurt a lot, but managed to survive... Steelix's Iron Tails, and got the Mineral Badge, which gave us six. Hooray! So after that, we we uh, we uh did random stuff. Like, we headed off to Union Cave and found the other exit, which re in involved us going downstairs, surfing across some water, and then finding the other exit into the Ruins of Alf, where we found the two other puzzles that we could do. One of the doors opened up and grabbed all the items, but we didn't read what the message was. But we solved both puzzles, so now the Ruins of Alf are completely solved. Except for whatever is written on the back doors. So we need to do two of those still, but... One of them is going to be a while, so we're just, we're just going to wait until we do that one then, before we go back, because there's no reason to go back now anymore. But, on this episode... We've been everywhere on the map except for one direction, and that is east of here. So, we're going to be heading east down. Well, that's not right. We went down on the, on the map, but that was incorrect. To Route 42. And also, there's the Mount Mortar, which we're going to be seeing. Just to get to our next town, Mahogany Town, which is right over there. However, I did a couple things first. First things first, I quickly went over to... Well, I, 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 went, I did a flying spree, and I gathered a bunch of berries from all the other berries things so that we could have more of the stuff. Because I kind of want to get rid of these antidotes, Paralyzed Heal, Awakenings, and Ice Heals, because they're kind of taking up space. Because our berries do the exact same stuff. I also went and bought a Moomoo Milk and some Lemonades, which is the higher tier of the drinks on the in the uh, department store. And a lot of fresh water, as you, as you can see. Turns out you can only buy one Moomoo Milk at a time. <laughs> and he won't sell you anymore if there's some in your inventory, so... Yeah. I also think he can only replenish it once a day. Um, we might need to test that. But yeah, I can only have one movement milk on me. Also, I... I'll, during my discoveries, found out that it was seven berries to cure that milk tank, not six, like I kept on thinking. Also... Sean's gone. Not Sean. Patrick's gone. Placed him with Fred. Reason for that? Fred can learn cu cut. Patrick can't. And uh, he can also learn surf. So, yeah. Now Fred's in the party. Also, because Fred is level 23, and that's great. Instead of a level 8. <laughs> Star me. And plus, we have Psychic covered by Sean, who barely shows up ever. <laughs> so, the reason I wanted Fred in the party is because I wanted a Pokemon that can know cut and surf. Because this next route would be a lot simpler if I only had one Pokemon that could do both. Instead of two Pokemon that can do both. Also, I really wish I would have done this before I did all the berry hunting. But yeah, we're going that way now. That So if you were wondering why Sean was not in his original place at the beginning of this episode and why Patrick was at the bottom, that's why. Alright, Route 42, which means new Pokemon territory. It's been a while since we caught a new Pokemon. Item up here. Ooh, a Thunderstone. It's a shame we don't have any Pokemon in our party that can evolve. Well, I mean, Fred can still evolve, and uh, Maggie can evolve, and Spyro is getting close to evolving, but none of them require stones. At least, the, at least getting the items and stones are great. So that's one thing that's good. Uh, so we have a cave. This is the entrance to Mount Mortar, as this sign will probably tell us. Mm -hmm. Waterfall cave inside. Not this one. The next one. Oh, actually, yeah, they're all Waterfall Cave. I want to surf first. Because there is a hidden item right here. Ooh, a Great Ball. That's good. We could use that. So this is why I want to cut and surf. Because I want to get inside there. Because Suicune's standing right there. So we need to go... We need to go alert Suicune. Also, there's a bunch of berry trees. Those are actually apricorn trees. Kind of like the triple the triple pair that was underneath Ecrotique. This is another triple pair of different colored apricorns. West of, uh, east of Ecrotique. 
And there's another cave. You better run. That's it. <laughs> That's all we needed cut for. And here's another cave. We'll not go in that one either. Not yet. Poison Barb. Ooh. Okay, so Poison Barb, I think, is the exact same as everything else we've been fighting, where it actually gives us a advantage for poison-type moves. Yes, it does. We haven't... <laughs> we don't have Repel on, do we? <laughs> we haven't run to a Pokemon yet. Here's a third cave and a bunch of enemies. Spire's in front. Let me demonstrate the power of the Pokemon I caught. Trying to go through Route 42 and we haven't found a single Pokemon. Fisher Tully wants to battle. Please tell me it's a Magikarp. Oh, that would've been funny. Only has level 18 Pokemon though, so. I mean, technically we could have gone this way after doing, uh, use the minimize. Look how tiny Quillfish is now. You know, we we could have we could have uh, we could have went this way instead of going west. I pick I, I pick Twister, which is a very low accuracy. And just do uh, there that hits. Poor tiny thing. What? What? That's not right. Did you? He must have just became a trainer because that was his only Pokemon, and he just caught it. So if we read this sign, Mount Mortar, waterfall cave inside. Hmm. So the three caves we've seen, they're all Mount Mortar. So the Mount Mortar has three different entrances. Here, let me talk to you. Hey, this is my secret place. Get lost, you outsider. We're, we're outside. <laughs> We're, we're outside in the middle of a route. This is not your place. Pokemaniac Shane wants the battle. Also, I had to shout, hey, because he shouted it. Need arena. This won't take forever like it used to with Spyro. I keep on saying that, yet Spyro still is having some trouble with the fights. Although not as much trouble as he used to with only Twister and Rap. I would have been very upset had that not actually fainted it. Come on, Spyro. Your goal is 30. Well, your first goal is 29. Then 30. Because I think at 29, he learns a new move. And 30, something happens. How did that do? <laughs> you did more damage to Nidorino than you did to Nidorina. The arena must have lower health. It doesn't matter. They both faded. Oh, you're so close. I should have used my Moonstone. <laughs> you're working on a Pokedex? Wow, you must know some pretty rare Pokemon. May I see it? Please? Please? Oh, if he only knew what Pokemon I didn't show him. Oh, and Maggie, too. Both of them would upset him greatly. <laughs> Alas, I won't. Ah, oh, it's good to be outside. I feel so free. <laughs> he must He must have came from Mount Mortar since he's a hiker. Hiker Benjamin wants to battle. He sent out a... Diglett! I'm gonna just destroy the Diglett. Yay! Go away! And Spire hit 26! Your Benjamin is about to use a Geodude. You know what? Let's switch. To who? I'm not sure. I know. Maggie, you're coming out. You're getting some experience. Man, you haven't been outside your Pokeball in a while now. And you're immediately going back in because Randy's coming out to finish his fight. 
Because Randy's getting close to a level up. He's not going to level up from this one fight, though. He might need to fight the next Pokemon to level up. Because this Pokemon's only level 14. Use Doug Trio. I will switch. Maggie's coming back out. She's not staying out. No way. Fire against ground is bad news. But she's close to leveling up. This might actually get her. The Doug Trio's level 16 again. Still is still. Uh oh oh. Okay. Thank God that we switched her out because that would have been bad. The magnitude four is one of the lower ones. It only did, it only did two. Or was Rand even hurt before that? He might have just did five for a crit hit. Maggie seventeen. Randy's thirty-one, and he passed a hundred health. Go. <laughs> I mean, we could... Do we want a water Pokemon? Do we want... Well, I mean, the Pokemon in the water aren't necessarily going to be water. Still need to get a Pokemon from this route. But if we just walk up here... That's the route. We're in Mahogany Town. We, we went through Route 42. Congratulations. I'm going to heal. The gym's also currently being blocked. It doesn't bode well. The last time they were blocked was when we were in Azalea Town. Okay. Well, I'm not gonna talk, well, we'll talk to them later. We're not done with Route 42 yet, because one, we gotta get a Pokemon. Two, we gotta explore Mount Mortar a little bit. And three, then we can explore Mahogany Town. Do I want Spyro up front? Yeah, let's have Spyro up front. I mean, the Pokemon that we find here is probably going to be close to Maggie levels. But whatever. I was wondering if I had Repel. I still don't. Ooh, a Sand Slash. Oh, which means I can't... I can't Thunder Wave it because it's Ground type. Oh, you poor thing. You're the, you're the first Pokemon to experience rap in a long time. I was about to say it's nice to have a ground type Pokemon. <laughs> Immediately forgetting that Godzilla exists. Oh, poor Godzilla. I don't want to do too many. Because I do want to catch this thing. Oh, he got released from rap. Whatever. It should be fine. There we go. I already know a name. I know I'm naming you. Adept at climbing trees, it rolls into a spiny ball that attacks its enemies from above. Yep. I, I know you're a mouse, but I don't care. You look like a hedgehog. <laughs> we caught Sonic. Yeah, he's not the fastest. We caught him. All right, so first things first. Mount Mortar. Now, there's several entrances to this place. Here's one of them. Mount Mortar is a weird cave. It's incredibly optional. We don't need to go in here. But... Also, in Gold and Silver, it's a dark cave, at which is you need Flash to go through it. Crystal, for some reason, it's not, so thank God for that. I'm going to do a repel because I don't want to fight anything yet. We will fight something here soon, but not right now. But there is actually stuff here as well. The reason this is called the Waterfall Cave is because right there's a waterfall. Also, right in front of me, there's an item. Ooh, another Dragon Fang. But, and this is going to blow people's minds because, it's going to blow some people's minds because it, it, I didn't find out about this until like a month ago and it blew my mind then. Uh, watch this. Right? 
We're in, we're in the back part of Mount Mortar now. Enter here. Ta-da! We are now on this side. We completely didn't need to use Surf at all here. <laughs> you don't need to Surf across Route 42 to get to the other side. You can just go through Mount Mortar. I say that blew my mind, it totally did. I did not know you could do this this way. I always surfed across Route 42. You don't need Surf to do this. Also, there's an item up here. That's not an item, that's a staircase. Oh, staircase leads to an item. Aha! <laughs> I, got another, I got another silver powder. I really want bug types, apparently. There is another another item. Now that you see this, this is a trap. <laughs> this, is a, this, is a, this is a strength trap. What it wants you to do... Well, technically, you can go either way with this. Never mind, it's not a strength trap. <laughs> I, take it, I take it back what I said. You can progress further. All right, hold on. Yeah, I'm going to have to fight you. I'm not losing this time. I don't know what level this po this guy's Pokemon are at. Pokemaniac Miller wants to battle. This might have been a mistake. No, never mind. I take that back. <laughs> the Needle King. Okay. If it was like 35, I would have freaked. I'd be like, uh-oh. But I'm fine. This is literally it's the same guy that was outside of the cave, but he actually used Moonstones. If his next Pokemon's a Nidoqueen, Queen, I'm gonna laugh. <laughs> it's exactly the same person! He went inside. Hi, Daisy! It's nice that we've seen several of the same Pokemon we used in Yellow. I mean, our party in Yellow was kind of OP. Because we got, like, given half of them. <laughs> Lost to some kid? That's a lot of money from you. Thank you. I just want this item. X Speed. Wonderful. I'm never using it. <laughs> We could, we could explore more. Okay, here's our Pokemon for this area. Ooh. An Electabuzz. We don't have an electric Pokemon yet. Which means I don't think I can... I, I don't think I can Thunder Wave you. You're gonna suffer the same fate as... Oh, what am I naming you? <laughs> what am I even gonna name you? I have a name idea, but I'm going to have to explain it, and it's going to be stupid. <laughs> I'm not even sure if it's correct. I take that back. I'm not naming you that. Oh, God. Oh, well, I forgot. Thunder's not very effective against us. Okay, Rap, that's good enough. It kind of sucks, because I didn't actually intend to get this Pokemon, but whatever. There's actually something that we could have gotten in Mount Mortar, but now this Pokemon's it, so... I wonder if I should... I, I will do it, but we're not going to be using whatever we get from it. When two Electabuzz touch, they control the electric currents to communicate their feelings. What even are you, Electabuzz? <laughs> All right, I don't know what I'm naming you. I'm just gonna name you. <sighs> Hold on, I'm gonna find, I'm gonna have to look into this. I need to find out what the trainer's name is, and I will... 
Okay, there it is. I know your name. All right, this is your name. Kaz. So, <laughs> I'm gonna have to explain that name. Kaz is the trainer name from the anime when Electabuzz showed up for the first time. And Electabuzz has one of the weirdest calls in the anime. <laughs> Also don't want to fight Diglett, so I'm running. We're done in Mount Mortar. I think we're done for this episode. The very well, no, we still have to explore Mahogany Town. If I can get out. I'm never gonna. I'm never gonna share what I was originally gonna name. <laughs> what I was gonna name Electabuzz. Well, having Electabuzz is nice, and we don't have any electric Pokemon, but our party is okay right now. I mean, we have, we have fighting, we have dark flying, we have water, we have psychic, we have fire, and we have dragon. That's a weird group, but it's working, so whatever. All right, so we're in Mahogany Town. The gym is closed. Go talk to the guy after we heal and find out why it's closed. Actually, let's talk to the people in here and find out why it's closed. What's this? Team Rocket has come back. I saw some men in black at Lake of Rage. Hmm. That's exactly why Azalea was closed. Pokemon be do become stronger when they evolve, but they also learn moves more slowly. And some don't learn at all. I stop my Pokemon from evolving too early. I make them learn certain moves before I let them evolve. Which I sometimes do. Especially when it comes to Gen 3 games, but... Not, not Nuzloxes. I don't need to. Since you came this far, take the time to do some sightseeing. You should head north and check out Lake of Rage right now. If you look at our map, there is a lake up there. Route 43 goes up to the Lake of Rage. Why is it called Rage? Find out next episode. <laughs> we will be going north next episode because if we go this way... Hi, kid. I see you're new in Mahogany Town. Since you're new, you should try a yummy Rage candy bar. Right now, it can be yours for just $300. Want one? No, thank you. Oh. Fine then. Unfortunately, he's gonna prevent us from going that way at all. And and even if we do buy one, he still won't let us go past. And I, I just don't wanna buy one because it only heals me for 20, which sucks. <laughs> Especially for 300 bucks, I could buy a, I could buy a water for that, for cheaper. And it does more. I'm putting the Thunderstone away because I forgot to. You can go away. You can go away. You can join your friend. You can join your friend. Oh yeah, I forgot. I, I should mention I also sorted this a little bit uh, between episodes just because I could. Understand you go up, join the other stones. The Thunderstone still at this point only evolves two Pokemon, correct? Some of the stones evolve multiple. Like the Moonstone had four in the first gen. I don't think any were added in gen two. I don't, I don't recall any ad additions of Waterstone either. Leaf Stone, maybe. Thunderstone, <laughs> I definitely not. Most, most of the new ways to evolve Pokemon are either from the friendship thing that we talked about, the happiness level, or giving them an item and then trading them. Although there are some other stones as well. I think I think we're gonna call it here. I mean, we do have this building to explore. While visiting Mah Mahogany Town, try a Rage Candy Bar. Okay, that's just an advertisement. I didn't mean to advertise them. I heard that a red Gyarados appeared at the lake. That's odd, since even ordinary Gyarados are rare in that lake. My favorite radio program? I'd say Pokemon Music. Okay. <laughs> so, 
that's going to do it for this episode. Up there is how we get to Route 43 in the Lake of Rage. So if we're going to be going that way, what do you have to say? Are you off to see the Gyarados Rampage at the lake? Well, I think we now know why it's called Rage. That's going to do it for this episode. We hit exactly 18 hours. Caught two new Pokemon. We caught a Sand Slash and an Electabuzz. Explored a little bit of Mount Mortar, including the super secret path that you can go through it just to get past the water. Also, we saw Suicune and scared them off again. But reached Mahogany Town, explored it. I mean, we didn't go in the building, but we'll do that later. And the gym is closed because he wants us to go up to Lake of Rage first. So that's going to do it for this episode. On the next episode of Pokemon Crystal Random Lock, we're going to be heading up Route 43. There's a lot of trainers there. Also, a new Pokemon advantage or attempt. And uh, get to the Lake of Rage and find out what's all the rage there. <laughs> so until next time, hopefully you enjoy. Enjoy.